What's up, guys? <clears throat> Welcome back for the next episode of Shiny Ski Resort. We back. We doing stuff, things, and we can research a leafy potted plant. Let's do that. The more research, the better. Uh, we still need boulders. Great. Uh, development's almost done. Then we'll be able to do this eventually. That'll get us some boulders. Uh, we got a decent amount of, uh, decent amount done here. It's a thousand. Where are we at? I think we're at mid right now. What's the maximum height? Oh, we're not even at mid yet. Interesting. Yeah, I'll have to start expanding up a little bit this way, eventually. Except for a potted plant. Love to see it. Blocked. Okay, that's fine. <clears throat> Guest rooms are doing just fine. Locker capacity is doing fine. I'm just kind of, just kind of waiting right now. It's the name of the game. Eventually, it's going to get to the point where uh, it gets so hot, we're not going to need the heaters anymore. We're going to need uh, fans. But uh, we'll get there eventually. Just keep developing where we can. <clears throat> I might move this ski lift again down here, kind of have it go up. We shall see. Light's already covering over here, so I think we'd be okay to do that. Got one guest right now. Yeah, just the one. Not too crazy. Town developers are so expensive. Can't even. Uh, boulders, sand, really? Come on, come on! Why are you so expensive? Well, the contract with Dream Tours has ended. Here's what we got from them. This extra forty thousand. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, we'll. Try to max out Dream Tours before we move on to the other one. Got six hours left on the, that. Uh, we have enough for this. That'll be that corner completely done. Yes. It's gonna take him a little while to get that done. <clears throat> It's an old box. I think just these singular trees are going to be old boxes. Jeez, I'm doing way out here. Handed, of course. Spacious room, very nice. Spacious room. We need five timber. We can get that done. We have enough, uh, enough wood. Spacious 
spacious rooms, I believe, can hold two people instead of just one. Don't know what the benefit is to using it other than the fact that it uh, looks a little bit better. Oh, nice. We can rank up. Let's do that. 50,000. It's going to be a lot of money, but that's fine. Sparkly mag, green carpet. And we got some light up bottles. Add celeb mascot. Course vibe improves based on how long the course is, counting from the lift to drop-off point. You can extend a course by adjusting the drop-off point location. Facilities built on ski course can also enhance its vibe. Large buildings or better lifts, for example, greatly contribute to that. Note, suddenly making the ski course longer may increase the risk of skiers having trouble and falling over. Yes, 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 yes. We don't really have to worry about that just yet. Um, because, <clears throat> uh... Yeah, we can't get very high into the mountain just yet, but uh, it's fine. Hi, boss. We got a message from the rental store. It says that they can rent grass skiing equipment when the snow melts. This way our guests can ski no matter what time of year it is. Oh, yes. Grass skiing, the popular pastime. <laughs> yeah, as you can see, our little, uh, our little snowmen are starting to melt. Little buggers. We can actually get some ads going. Maybe throw in a radio station. Get a little bit. <clears throat> Our uh, actual popularity isn't too great, all things considered, so. Yeah. Got some light up bottles. Those are kind of neat. All the lights you can change the color of, by the way. Uh, okay, so we can do the snowbell. Go ahead and get that done. Uh, pot of plant, might as well. Uh, oh, we already have two projects going, so we can't do another one. It's fine. Uh, once one of those finishes, we'll get water, and then I think we'll gain access to stones. stone process. Wonderful. Uh, I think we needed five of these. Yep. Okay. Yeah, I would very much like to get uh, that sooner than later. I will show you why here shortly. Uh, we could probably afford to move our single chairlift. some of this stuff around, just to kind of get it out of the way. Okay. Hey, FL. Yeah, of course I'm having fun. It's a Kairosoft game. I always have fun with Kairosoft games. Okay, so let's, uh... Move all this around. I uh, can't afford to put that there. Dang it. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but okay. Is it just the little management games? I just enjoy them a fair amount. Too much stuff in the way. Dang it. Alright, I guess we can't really afford to rotate it that way, unfortunately. We'll just have to clear out more space. Nice. Snowball's complete. I don't think the snowbell does same thing as the other statues. Fairly certain, but uh, just in case it does, uh, I'll put it uh, here. 
it'll at least get us more customers. Uh, even in summer, it's cooler here in the mountains than down in the cities, but it can still get pretty hot. Take a look at this. It's a fan. Very lovely. <laughs> yeah, you saw that I have 999 followers, right? Almost into those, you know, quadruple digits. Oh yeah, while people are out here hiking and stuff, they'll just kind of rummage around in the forest and find materials. It's kind of neat. Wow, what a pretty place. Maybe I can find my true love here, just like in the movies. Remember a scene when a girl and her boyfriend ring a snow bell at a mountain resort? So romantic. And we got a cute student. Nice. Yeah, I don't think that the snow bell's gonna do what I thought that it might do. The little snowman are having such a hard time. He's smiling, but on the inside, he's dead. <laughs> All right. Nice. Now this will definitely do what uh, I kept talking about. Yes, these uh, take up the exact same space as two rooms, but uh, I, 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 I don't know what the benefit is um, just yet, other than the fact that they're probably more comfortable, maybe they appeal more, I don't know. Um, either way, let's see about getting a pinky statue. Okay, so Piggy Statue, uh, when skiers ski by it, there's a chance that, one, they'll get more experience, uh, and they will also give us research points. So you kind of want to put it near where skiers are going to be uh, uh, from your drop-off point. So we'll uh, put it there. We can only build one for now, but uh, it's not that big a deal. Um, we can put some more, you know, silly little snowmen around. You know, dying snowmen. No big deal. So you'll see when they uh, get dropped off here and go through here. See how his experience went up to one point something or other? 1.65 or whatever. Normally they only get like 1.2 or 1.3 or whatever. But uh, gives them more. And then uh, I haven't talked about it yet, but in the top right hand corner you see that green icon with a 10. Those are your research points. Um... <clears throat> Those are used for, uh, as a currency for other things, uh, later on for, like, upgrading, you know, materials and, you know, equipment that people can use. And did you just find an egg in the forest? That's cool, I guess. Stealing stuff from the resort. Um, they're not actually stealing. Uh, we get all that stuff. Okay, yeah, you see this guy? He just got a little green icon above his head. Uh, that means that he generated us a point, which is always lovely. Uh, and the fact that they don't just, like, run into the statues and die, so that's cool, too. But, uh, yeah. Eventually, you might want to consider speeding up your lifts. But, uh, yeah, at this point, it's it's not that big a deal for us. So this, uh, this person should go through here, and there they go. There they go. Didn't get us any research, but that's fine. Could also put it like, I don't know, here, maybe? Alright, this doesn't do what I thought it did, so I'm just gonna put it over here. I thought the snowbell might have done the same thing that the piggy statue does, or any of the statues do, but it doesn't, so it's fine. It's not that big a deal. Nice, we got 7000G. Thank you, Dream Tours. Okay, should research the fan. Nice. Uh, I might make a block of uh, more spacious rooms over here. <clears throat> Just as a, uh, I don't know, not like luxury, but, but uh, I don't know, just something for people that maybe want to pay more. Consider it a, uh, something like that. Why not? I'll even give them sparkly mats. Ooh, fancy. What do you think 
think about that. Bourgeois and shit. Let's see. They're gonna want... Gonna want this. <clears throat> That'll cover actually everybody. get researched. We'll throw one of those down. I don't know if this is going to cover the entire room, since it's only overlapping from one side. I guess we'll see. Looks like it is, though. Hey, how's it going? Thought you might want to expect... Okay, yeah, of course, the second that I start to cram all this crap in here, they hit me with the expansion. Jerks. Oh, it's 30,000. It's not too bad, I guess. Especially when you compare it to some of the other costs. Oh yeah, I need to build more of these so that way the uh, the rabble can't see the uh, the the high rollers. There we go. <laughs> Got to separate them out. You know how you know how it is. You know how it is. Nice. Fan research is done. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do that. It's gonna cover all that. Uh, unfortunately, I can't really get away with doing the same thing here unless I move these rooms around, which I think I'm going to. It's not super efficient anyway how I've got everything set up, so let's uh, move some of this. And I'm sorry, guest, but can't be bothered right now. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, that should cover everything. Wonderful. And I could probably put in another room here. Get away with that. I don't think it'll get us a, a cramped kind of a thing. I think we'd be okay to do that. Yeah. There we go. Spent, like, all of our money, but that's fine. Not too bad. Not too bad. Immediately checked in the second I bought them. Okay. Nice. over there, but whatever. Not that big a deal. You know, it's um, it's a tough call. I don't know which of the Kairosoft games is my favorite just yet. Uh, but uh, I like this one so far. This one's pretty cool. We've done some pretty neat things with it so far. Hello, I have a suggestion for your resort. Folks like me who want to get fit before skiing season starts, can you research a gym? Mini gym. Probably get started on that. What do we need? Five timber. Easy peasy. Nice. More places for people to spend money. You love to see it. Love to see it. Nobody's checking into our expensive rooms. <clears throat> what the hell? Sure, why not? And the appeal. 
heal us. Not too bad. B is 2,500 though. That's, uh, that's a lot more than uh, these other rooms. I guess it makes sense why, uh, why people aren't necessarily flocking to them. What kind of bonus do these have? 300? It's not too bad. It's not too bad. Once we get the gym going, we can get another combo uh, as well. I think it's a fan, a gym, and a bench or an auto vendor. Something like that. don't know what we do with fodder just yet. <clears throat> Did not get that far when I was playing uh, by myself, so that'll be interesting to see. Uh, mini gym. or not. But we'll see. Either way, it probably wouldn't be a bad idea to get another uh, another setup of this whole thing. <coughs> nice. uh, okay, since we're all good on them, I guess we could take a break on doing them. I'm gonna wait, actually. Tours that'll give us the dark bean cafe. That's another thing that I definitely want. All right, so that wasn't the necessary thing. Now the game is not compatible. Ooh, interesting. Did not actually know that that was the case. Uh, if that's the case, uh, let's see here. Let's, uh real quick. There it is, yeah, so it is the, uh, it is that, which means <clears throat> I should put this back before people get super pissed. <laughs> now, what's going on here? Auto vendor... Not compatible, my ass. You just went straight from the mini gym to the fucking mallet game, you liar. <laughs> Alright, uh, this just has to stay near an auto vendor, so I could actually put this over here. As far as compatibility is concerned. There we go. Uh, and then... We could probably get a combo going of this, I think. Uh, yeah, it's the round tree, so we could get that going. Alright, I want to make sure that this has a pretty decent length that it'll spread, as far as our facilities are concerned, so... Um, we could probably just do like that. be able to just do this as well? No, okay, it only counts for the one. That's fine. You can just move this somewhere. There we go. Right, that extends the break time over there. <clears throat> Not 
And the reason why I waited, because, uh, I wanted them to both get sponsored at the same time, so that way, uh, we don't have to wait that, like, awkward couple of minutes in between them. There we go. Nice. I got popularity up for all of our rooms. Popularity of 29. It's nothing to, nothing to sneeze at, but it's also not, like, super great. <clears throat> Popularity is almost 800. You'd love to see that. Uh, Alright, we just need the money and we can rank up. It's pretty exciting. Uh, five timber and we can make the Dark Bean Cafe. Yeah, we're gonna do that. We are gonna do that. A lot of people like the cafe. Oops, Although, hotel expansion wouldn't be a bad idea. We are kind of running out of a little bit of room here. <coughs> oh, there goes the popularity. It always happens whenever you hit like a new month. <coughs> Don't know why. But, uh, went straight back up, so I don't know. doing pretty well. <laughs> All things considered. Nice. Okay. I don't want to put that down until I have the cafe table, because uh, I want to do them all at the same time. Also, haven't been doing any uh, development. Don't want to start slacking on that. Lively kids' funds went up, heck yeah. So cramped. Oh, maybe they can't walk through here. That's unfortunate. Probably can't walk through there. That sucks. <coughs> well, if that's the case, I'll have to shift some things around. Carpeting back here is just disgusting, so let's uh, fix that. Alright, so they shouldn't have the cramped issue with these rooms anymore, hopefully. Not too bad. Okay, so we can go ahead and build the cafe tables. Better question might be... Where do we want our cafe? Hmm. Could just kind of throw it in the middle here. I might do that. I'm 
might do that. It is kind of a nice spot for it. <clears throat> yeah, sure. We can always move it later if we want to. As far as tables are concerned. Don't need a whole lot of them. No, we didn't yet. I think we have to rank up for wood floors. <coughs> Which would be nice. Don't get me wrong. Alright. Right, well, anyway. That is going to do it for that episode. If you guys liked it, feel free to hit that like button, leave a comment down below, so on and so forth. 